Hi guys, today I'm pleased to tell you that videos related to best Mac apps are back. However, I won't be reviewing 5 or 10 best Mac apps in one video. I will only be reviewing one best Mac app per video. And it also takes less time for me to scout for new awesome Mac apps for you. Hopefully, I could post each new Mac app each weekend, while the other weekdays, I will be focusing on other kinds of videos. Okay, without further delay, let's get started. The best Mac apps for today is called Tooth Fairy. Please do not confuse that this app has anything to do with the teeth. Basically, what this app does is that it allows you to connect or disconnect any of your connected Bluetooth devices with just one click. What's really surprising is that this app allows you to connect or disconnect your Bluetooth device much faster than the traditional method. So let me show you an example here. So currently I add my AirPods Pro and if I open the lid for my AirPods Pro and I connect and it's connect. But the problem is that you have to click on this, you have to go here and then connect and disconnect which is time consuming. What happens if you just click on an icon? Here, after you add it, usually when you install this app for the first time, it will prompt you to add any of your Bluetooth devices to this Tooth Fairy app. It will look like this, and then you select one, and you click select, it will pop up here. You can see two icons at the top here. So let's remove one, let's focus on only one. So I have my AirPod Pro here. This one, you click only one time, it's connect very fast. Once connected, you will see that the icon is actually darker or it turns black to show that it's connected. It even show you the battery level percentage, like left 100%, right 90%. You click another one, it will disconnect very quick. There are also three other cool features of this app that makes you fall in love with this app. So in order to go to its setting, if you click on this, it only connect or disconnect. The trick for going to its setting is that you have to click Click on control key and then you click on this icon left click it will show the preference click on preference so the first cool feature is that it allows you to add the specific icon of the Bluetooth specific device directly at the menu bar for better and easier access. So this Bluetooth device here, you can add its specific icon like my AirPods Pro. You can just click here to change the icon and you can see the icons, lots of icon. And here is the right AirPods Pro icon. Click on it, it will change to look really cool here. And the same thing, you click on it, one click, you see it changed to darker or black and that's connected. You click on it again, disconnect very quick. The second cool feature is that for a much faster connection or disconnection, you can add a keyboard shortcut to each specific Bluetooth device. Here, it's a global hotkey to connect or disconnect. That is the keyboard shortcut. Currently, I set it to control number one. You can set any shortcut. So if you click on it, it allows you to choose the shortcut you want. So the shortcut have to be the combination of keys like control or option or command plus any letters or number. Again, I would choose control number one. If I click control number one, it will reconnect. Let's see, control number one. Wait for it, see it connected. You click control number one again, it's disconnect very fast. This is this would come very handy, especially when you want to swap between your devices. Let's say you are using your AirPods right now with the iPhone or iPad and now you want to switch it to use with your Mac. Let's say if I connect my AirPod to my device, click here, it's the AirPod here, click connect. Now it's connected. I want to look at this right here it's connected but if I click control number one look at it now my computer is connected and it just disconnect from my iPhone it's very quick with this it's like a, a time saving feature even though you're connected to your iPhone or iPad but with just one shortcut key or one click you can just switch between your device and your Mac it's really cool. And the third cool feature of this app is that you are able to see the battery estimate next to the Bluetooth device icon. So I have my AirPods Pro here. If I want to add the battery estimate next to it, again, I click Control key, click on it, go to preferences, 
and then you take this show battery status in the menu bar click there it will show the battery status of my bluetooth device it's really cool which means i don't have to check my battery percentage by going to the bluetooth setting and then going to my airpods pro and then check it here that would take a long time i just look at here it's just right there the bluetooth estimate is next to it i do not have to move my cursor next to it to see my bluetooth battery percentage i just look at this right here and then i can estimate that oh right now my bluetooth battery percentage is almost full which means i still can use it for a longer time so it's really awesome with this Mac app. Being able to just switch to connect or disconnect your Bluetooth device, especially your AirPod Pro or AirPods or any other Bluetooth device quickly like that is really awesome. You can even add more Bluetooth device icon. Now let's add another one by going to its setting, click control, click on here, preference. The plus sign here to add and I have my AirPods. This is the normal AirPod, the first generation select and now I can customize the icon click here you can just choose this one and show battery percentage as well click OK and because I'm using the app called vanilla it will hide one side of my icons so that it won't look messy I have to move it to the other side it's pretty easy and it's connected if I want it to disconnect the same thing disconnect want it to connect You can switch between AirPods easily with this. Just use the shortcut key like Command 1 for the first AirPod and Command 2 for the second AirPod. It's really cool. Okay, that's it guys. This is Tooth Fairy, the best Mac apps for connecting or disconnecting Bluetooth device from your Mac conveniently. Thank you so much for watching. If you like the video, please give us a thumbs up, comment down below and subscribe for more useful videos in the future. Have a great day guys. See you in the next video.